Good morning, my brothers and sisters in Christ, and let's dive into the Word. In today's Gospel, we see the Sadducees questioning Jesus about life after death. To begin with, these Sadducees did not believe in the resurrection. They believed that we live here on earth now, and once we die, well, that's about it. It's interesting to see that that belief existed in the community over 2,000 years ago, when we see that exact same belief existing right now in today's day and age. The narrative that there's no life after death and that we only have these few short years to live for isn't a new concept. It's existed for generations. Our culture thrives in the narrative of YOLO, you only live once. So live life to the max right now. But if it were true that we only have this life here on earth to live for, and that once we turn to dust, then it all just comes to an end, doesn't that make life a little bleak? Then what's the point of waking up and going to work and doing everything we do in life? Jesus replies with hope. He speaks of the resurrection of the body, and we see that in full display in Christ's resurrection from the dead. Jesus mentions that even Moses called God as the God of Abraham, the God of Isaac, and the God of Jacob. He is not the God of the dead, but of the living, and for to him all are alive. The thing is, by Moses' time, Abraham, Isaac, and Jacob had been dead for quite a while now, and yet God is described as being the God of these three men. Logically speaking, how is that possible? Unless, unless, in one way or another, these three men are still alive. And yes, these three men are still alive in the presence of God. Let's reflect on our lives, sisters and brothers. Are we living our lives just for the present moment? Do we do what we do on a daily basis just to achieve comfort or what the world would define as fun? Or on the contrary, are we saddened by the fact that our lives here on earth aren't going the way we hope it would be? Does the mundane, repetitive life we are living dampen our hopes for the future? In both cases, may today's reflection be a reminder that there's more to life than just the here and now. Let it give us hope that we have a life awaiting us in the presence of God that is beyond our human understanding. Our lives here on earth are meant to glorify God in every aspect. May every decision we make today bring us closer to God. Have a blessed day ahead.